Hello everybody, this is Ryan. Really going to be, looks like a really hot week, but right now we have storm clouds and there's thunder and we have all these clouds converging on our point. And so, I hope we get some good storms from it. We shall see. There's a little treat for you because the rest of the week is going to be hot. My week starting right now. This is my week. Okay, just to show you guys real quickly, remember I'd tell you whenever there would be another Hobbit um, vlog coming out. I told you there was one last week, but there is another one that came out this week as well. So Peter Jackson is just letting them uh, fly up online. So here is another Hobbit vlog, and I haven't actually watched this yet. So I'm just going to click the play and... Hello and it. welcome to our next video blog. I thought it would be good to carry on talking to Andy Circus about some of the fun and games we had uh, during our first block of shooting. Andy. Andy? Where is he? Andy! What is this place? This isn't Wellington. I think they're trying to do a super spy type theme to this vlog. I love how they do themes to each and every vlog. It's kind of cool. <laughs> you know what? I, I think we should just run the blog anyway. So what we did is we asked cast and crew to tell us a few of their favorite memories from the first three or four months of shooting. So please enjoy that and I'll go figure out where I am. Okay, showed you a little bit of the vlog, but I'm not going to show all of it to you. I'll sh give you a link description so you can view it, view it yourself, or hopefully you're monitoring it yourself so you've already seen it. But if you haven't seen it, my goodness, these vlogs are probably just to be about as good as the movies. I hope these vlogs are actually put into the DVDs when they're done, like producing everything, making everything. It's great stuff. I mean, I'm laughing, I'm half crying. There's like a lot of characters that you're seeing that are coming back, that are making their way back into these. It's just, it's 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 incredible what they're doing in, in this type of film production. It's it's monumentous. I mean, the amount of time and energy that it takes to make a film like this. So my hat's off to Peter Jackson for not only doing this film, but also letting us, the fans and other filmmakers, enjoy the ride along along with him and his cast and crew just to see you know how these films are made the opinions of of the of the cast members and, and the crew and just their journey in general so thank you so much for showing these and like i said there's going to be a link in the description and i'll talk I'll, I'll see you guys in a little bit i'm sure there's more that's going to be happening this week here is salad mm -hmm. here are the animals oh. <laughs> Here are more beans. Green beans. And here are quesadillas. Although, kind of sort of quesadillas because we didn't have time to make like the tortillas, so we got pita bread from the store, and they still make a really darn good quesadilla. So we put almond cheese, uh, soy mayonnaise, soy hummus, right? No, just uh, the chick. Hmm? Oh, chick chickpea hum hummus. Yeah. Oh, okay. And so it's all blended together, and we have a, a cake. We have a quesadilla maker, and just put them in there, and voila! Throughout like last week and this week, we have an unusual eating ritual. Of we're not eating really on 
any table because Priscilla's dad is fixing up the tables. This used to be, believe it or not, just a really cheap coffee table and Priscilla's dad now makes it look like it was purchased from like a millionaire store. And the same thing with like the other tables he's been like painting those, making them look just like new. I mean we got all the all these tables second hand except for the Japanese table which is fine. But all the rest uh, were second hand stuff and now Priscilla's dad's just painting them, fixing them and making them look like they are just like new and they can and Im your image can be reflected off the table, see? You can see the the, the red dot too. <laughs> so yeah really cool and hopefully by next week we'll be able to eat on, on these tables and the paint will dry. This is hilarious, I have to vlog this. Uh, today I was meeting with a client out on the city, uh, we both really don't know the area very well but we're meeting at one central spot. What happened is the power was out at the place and so we thought okay we'll just find another place to visit like a coffee shop or somewhere, somewhere public and the coffee shop's power was out. Then we realized oh powers out everywhere and I think the reason is because that it is a freaking hot day outside. It's been hot all week but it is really hot today. Although I think yesterday was a little bit hotter but still hot day and it's probably why it powers out. Everybody's just pulling their ACs, amping up their ACs and they have to shut grids down. So hopefully they don't do that in my grid district because I'd hate to be without uh, air conditioning. But yeah, so I wasn't able to show my client anything. I'll have to end up posting the stuff to her online. And oh well, so much, so much for meeting person to person with clients. <laughs> but anyway, funny story. As you can see, I am sweating. I am going to go home and get back into my air conditioning as long as it's still on. Just to give you guys a quick recap update about yesterday with the town and its power out where I was supposed to be meeting somebody found out why the power was out there it was actually from the storm that happened earlier during the week in the intro of the vlog. I guess the storm knocked out the power and it's still been out the last few days all week so sorry for the town I mean that kind of stinks when that happens. Hopefully the power will be back on for them soon so they can have cool air because it's a bad week for the power to go out just from a little storm. I thought I'd give you an update on that and I have a lot of editing work to do now since I've been sick the past uh, week and a half. My week is finished and I will see you guys next week.